Oahu brothers are keeping watch over an invasive lizard they found in Kailua today. The brothers were working on a home when they spotted the green lizard in a tree. It held a, a bird in its mouth. They had a feeling this was not a native lizard, so they contacted us for help. Alexander Zeng joins us with a story you'll see only on KHON2. Alexander? That's right, Joe. We heard back from the Department of Agriculture, and a spokeswoman confirmed the lizard is an invasive Cuban night anole. There, there's a known population of this lizard in Windward, Oahu, but it is still considered an invasive creature because it eats birds and bird eggs. What was supposed to be a typical day on the job for brothers Ryan and Nick Lundquist ended with a surprise. Oh my God, what is it? I don't know. We're going to have to try and catch it, right? I mean, that thing's not supposed to be here. And I seen, uh, it looked like a little green bird, but it looked all kind of mangled or whatnot. It looked kind of weird. And then the next thing I know, it turns to the left, and it looks, there's a big old lizard eating it. So I yelled to my brother, you got to get up here, you know, <laughs> come on up come to the roof. Come here, come here, I've never seen nothing like this before. <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? So I like run up the ladder, and I'm like ready to look at something like maybe like a, a helicopter crash or like something like, you know, <laughs> that's like, like, and I'm looking, he's like, no, look in the tree. And I'm like, oh, what is that? And it was uh, the lizard eating the bird, and I was like, oh, my uh. goodness. <laughs> The brothers had a feeling something was unusual about this lizard. I cut the branch, he's holding it, and he has his gloves on. So as soon as we cut the branch, the thing jumps onto his hand. <laughs> and he's like, where is it? And I'm like, it's on your hand. And he's like, what? And he looks, and it jumped onto the roof, and then he, he straight grabs it, and it just goes, and starts, like, biting his hand. Bro, the thing started biting Yeah, yeah. just whipped his head around. Yeah. Like, nah, I, like, just lying on yeah. my head. They managed to get the lizard into a bucket and called the Hawaiian Humane Society for help. Yeah. Just invasive species, you know what I mean? Like, what do we do with it? We call uh, Humane Society, mm -hmm. dealing our, nobody's answering nothing, so Channel 2 News, but straight there, boom. We send it to him, and they like two seconds. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that'll reply. The Department of Agriculture is in charge of invasive pests, so we called their pest hotline. After no answer, we reached out to the department's spokeswoman, who told us because of budget cuts nearly a decade ago, the hotline is no longer manned after business hours. And because the lizard is contained, they're asking the brothers to hold on to it until someone can collect it in the morning. A couple of brave brothers. Now, if you see an invasive animal, call the state pest hotline at 643-PEST. Alexander Zanes, KHON2 News.